Hello, and welcome to another TA Tech Tip. In this tech tip, we'll discuss how to change the sample and tear hangdown wires on a Discovery 5500 TGA. To change the hangdown wire, first, lower the furnace to gain access to the wire. Next, remove the single screw found on the rear of the top cover. Remove the cover, exposing the metal balance housing. Using the 964th ball driver found in the accessory kit, loosen the four screws holding the metal balance housing. The screws only have to be loosened enough to allow the metal anchors to be rotated out of the groove in the housing. Remove the balance housing by lifting straight up and loosen the two captive thumb screws and remove the balance cover plate. If necessary, remove the foam pieces within the balance. The upper furnace assembly, shown here, has a hole in the center, which the tool to remove the hangdown wire must be inserted through, as shown in the next sequence. Select the sample loading tool from the accessory kit. Please note if the sample loading tool has a flange at one end. It may be removed prior to use, though it is not necessary. Insert the tool partially into the furnace and then carefully raise it up around the hangdown wire and insert it through the hole previously noted. Raise it high enough so that the auto sampler can be manually rotated underneath the tool and the tool can be allowed to rest on the tray. Gently grasp the hangdown wire and lift up and through the eyelet in the decoupler loop. Release the hangdown wire, letting it fall into the tool. Rotate the auto sampler tray away from the tool and slowly lower the tool until it and the hangdown wire are clear of the upper furnace assembly. Using the tool, pick up the new hangdown wire from its case. Insert the tool partially into the furnace and then slowly raise the tool, being careful to insert it and the hangdown wire into the hole in the upper furnace assembly. Raise the tool until the hangdown wire is visible from the top. This may require moving the thermocouple to the side or up. Using tweezers, gently grasp the hangdown wire and insert it through the eyelet in the decoupler loop. Remove the tool when finished. To remove the tear hangdown wire, first, using the 764th ball driver from the accessory kit, loosen, but do not remove, the three screws holding the tear cover in place. Rotate the tear cover clockwise and lower it. Next, remove any tear pan suspended from the tear hangdown wire. Insert the tool into the hole and around the hangdown wire. Using a pair of tweezers, gently grasp the hangdown wire and lift up and through the eyelet in the decoupler loop. Let it drop into the tool. Insert the hangdown wire into the tool the same way as before. Insert the tool with the hangdown wire into the opening and push upwards until the hangdown wire is visible from above. Using tweezers, gently grasp the hangdown wire and insert it through the eyelet in the decoupler loop. Remove the tool when finished. Then replace the tear cover. Replace the metal balance cover, rotate the anchors into the slot, and tighten the four screws with the 964th wrench from the accessory kit. Finally, replace the cover and secure the single screw in the rear. In this tech tip, we discussed how to change the sample and tear hangdown wires on a Discovery 5500 TGA. Please stay tuned for more helpful tips from TA Instruments and thank you for your interest.